Hey everybody, it's Vanessa, the Crafty Gemini. I'm tuning in here from my shop in Gainesville, Florida, the Crafty Gemini Fabric Shop and Studio, and I wanted to bring y'all a random little impromptu live chat to let you know that my new online sewing course is now open and available for signups in my online shop. You can head over to craftygemini.com, uh, just click the shop tab and you'll see the first post there. The class that we're making next, hey Laura, is the Michelle tank. This is Jolly pattern 3911. This is the next pattern that we're working on. If you've missed out on maybe some of my online sewing courses or you're not sure what it is, I teach specific Jolly patterns. This is a French Canadian company. It's a mother and daughter duo. They're amazing. And I've been making raglan t-shirt and tank top, racer back tank top patterns, t-shirts, tunic lengths, and even dresses. Um, teaching you some different ways to hack the patterns. Hi, Carla. Hey, Laura. And uh, we made a Charlie Bomber jacket class, another one of their patterns. These are all part of the PDF and video workshop courses that I teach online. Let me stop shaking the table. I see my camera's moving a little bit. Sorry about that. Go ahead and let me know if you're tuning in where you are tuning in from. I am located in North Central Florida, in Gainesville, Florida. Let's see. Alonso's asking if there's plus sizes included. So let's talk a little bit about the pattern. The pattern pack comes like this. It's a hard copy pattern. It is sold separately, so it's not part of the online course. Uh, we have the early bird sale price running right now for the video course. It's 50 bucks if you sign up between now and Sunday. What is that, the 23rd of this month? So I wanted to go through a Friday. Hopefully that's like a payday for people if you wanna sign up. Saturday and then Sunday night at midnight, Eastern Standard Time, which is where I'm located, the sale price is going to end. So it'll go up $25. So if you wanna get in on the video course, it's 50 bucks now until Sunday night at midnight. And then it goes up to $75. So let's talk a little bit about it. The pattern that we're working on is gonna be the Jali 3911. I said the pattern is sold separately. We carry this in stock in our online shop. We sell them for only $12, which is kind of amazing because this pattern has 28 sizes in it and typically they sell for about $14 or $15 per pattern. So if you wanna get the hard copy pattern to follow along and sign up for the video course, definitely head over to my online shop. The website is craftygemini.com slash shop, okay? This is the pattern on, let me show you one here, the cover without the plastic, maybe the glare won't show up as much. These are the dress versions. So it's called the Michelle Tanks and Dress. So there's three different views that we'll be working on. And when I teach these classes, we are going to do all the views. And that's what I always do when I teach these patterns. It's not just the tank top. We'll be working through the tank tops. And you can see there's two here. I don't know if you can see, but view B has kind of a little line there just under the bust line because it has a facing. So there is a partial lining. Then view A, which is the first one, is fully lined. And I, let me see if I have one here. Actually, I think it's on my table. Let me grab it because I have samples of both to show you. This tank top. So here's one, and I'll show you one of each view. So this is view A. This is a rayon chalet, and it's fully lined. So let me see if I can show you here. The lining is this teal fabric. So when you make it fully lined, how cool is this? It's a reversible tank. So the front and back of the necklines are the same. It's like a slight V-neck. So I made this one so it's basically two shirts in one. So I can wear it like this if I want to or wear it to the orange side depending on what color I feel like wearing. So this is gonna be view A and I'm gonna walk you through again every single step of how to make it. So view A is the fully lined and reversible tank. Then view B is the other one that I said that has a lining, but it's just the facing. So we're gonna start off with this one in the online video course because it uses less yardage. So it's gonna be a way for you to kind of walk into the pattern without doing the fully lined versions, okay? So let's see, Peggy's asking, will you have these in the shop also for those of us that are local? Yeah, we carry the patterns, we have fabrics for it. You can see maybe up there, ooh, this way up here, I have Rayon Chalet prints and then we have some down there also. We are working on listing them to the website as well and I've ordered even more Rayon Chalet prints uh, and solids actually. So th this is the fabric that I recommend for it. Okay, so that's what we're gonna start off with. This is the tie-dye version and if you go to craftygemini.com slash shop, in the product description page for the class, the online video course with the early bird sale price, you'll see my daughter wearing the same one because I used the same fabric and made her one in her size. So the pattern includes 28 sizes, and I'll recap that. 
It goes from a little girl size two all the way to a woman size 24. So any sizes within there, you'll be able to make this pattern, okay? Now, there's no closure. It's kind of a loose fitting top. You just slip it over. A few elements that I really, really love. If you've seen tank tops like this online from other independent pattern companies, I'll point out some of the differences that I really love. The straps are wide enough to cover bra straps. So there's other tops like this, but they're really more like spaghetti straps. And if you're large busted or you wear bras that have wider straps, it doesn't work that well, right? So this right here is this super fun, uh, it's a rayon chalet print and it also uh, is this funky tie dye. So let me pull it up here so you can see. This is the lining part, the facing that just covers the bust. So it doesn't reach all the way to the bottom. It stops right about here, just past the bust line and it works, okay? So this uses less yardage and that's the one that we're gonna start off with. So instead of going views A, B, and C, we're gonna go views B, A, and then C, okay? So if you wanna make the top longer, feel free to, right? The joy of making your own clothes is that you can do whatever you want with it if you're trying to stay with the silhouette. So some people have asked already, if we can add sleeves to this. We can't without completely redoing the pattern, right? The pattern has been drafted to be a sleeveless tank top, so that's what we're gonna be working on, okay? Can you do it in a cotton, Hope is asking. I've made it in a double gauze, which is kind of a light, flowier cotton, and you need something that really has a lot of drape, especially if you have a larger bust than a B cup, because since your bust sticks out here, if the fabric doesn't drape smoothly, it's just gonna tent out. And so one of the things that we're gonna do to combat that is a full bust adjustment, which is actually gonna be one of the video lessons that are, I'm gonna cover and I'm gonna teach you how to do in the online video course. So not only am I walking you through views A, B, and C, step-by-step step how to make everything on a sewing machine, okay? You're not gonna have to use a serger, but I will show you, if you have a serger, some of the quick ways that you can finish it, okay? For example, in the facing hem here, Sometimes I don't even bother to turn it under and hem it. I'll just do a rolled hem on my serger and it's finished, boom, and I'm out the door, right? But on a regular sewing machine, we can do just a small hem there to hem it under and finish off that bottom edge of the facing. So we can do that too. All right, so I showed you views A, the fully lined and reversible. And this is something that I tell people too. This is reversible because I did the front and back in the same fabric. Now think about if you did four fabrics. Okay, if you did four fabrics, you could do the front one fabric, the back another, and then the inside lining, one the third fabric and one the fourth. So say you're wearing it underneath a sweater or a cardigan, you can have four tank tops in one. So that's also gonna be another option, and it's gonna be an option that's gonna allow you to use up smaller pieces of you know whatever flowy, lightweight, woven fabric that you're going to use. So if we did four different prints of a rayon chalet and wore it under a cardigan, Again, four tank tops in one. This would make a perfect kind of versatile garment to throw in your bag if you're traveling, business work, and stuff like that. All right, so now view C is the dress. And remember, if you're just tuning in, we are launching my new Michelle, this is Jali Pattern 3911 online video course. To sign up, just head over to craftygemini.com slash shop, or you can just go to craftygemini.com, click on the shop tab, and right there you'll see it. You can sign up at the early bird sale price of 50 bucks. That price ends this coming Sunday, uh, or June, June 23rd at 11.59 p.m. Then the price is gonna go up to $75. So, view A, fully reversible uh, and fully lined garment. The one that we talked about, you can do four fabrics or two fabrics, whatever you want. Then view B, the one with the facing that I showed you. And then view C is actually a dress. So I have two options here, and I'm gonna share with you some different changes and stuff that I made because if you have a similar body type to me or you like to wear things similar to me, you'll also see ways that we can kind of hack the pattern a little bit, maybe to just get rid of some of uh, the extra oomph that we have at the waistline. So first I'll show you the regular one. This is kind of a lightweight polyester, but it's more like um, pushing towards medium weight, okay? But it's this fun kind of chevron -y print. And this is my favorite part, you guys, about view C pockets. So I had made this tank top also out of this rayon chalet print and I only had a few chunks left over but it was just enough to make the pockets. So how fun is that to add a pop of color and fun to your uh, summer dress pockets. So that's what I did here so you'll learn how to make and attach pockets in the side seams. Super easy. Then the bodice part here is fully lined 
all right, with the same fabric. And then we have a gathered waistline and then a little dress. And there's a video, uh, not a video, but a picture of me in the course description page that you can see me wearing this one with my hands in the pockets. Super duper cute, light, breezy. Again, there's no closure, there's no zipper, there's no buttons, there's no um, hook and eye, there's nothing. You just slip this on so you can imagine it's already designed to be pretty loose fitting, okay? Then I made it out of a drapier rayon chalet, this crinkle rayon chalet, which we're gonna have this listed on our website for sale as soon as I can get all the fabrics listed. But these pockets I made out of the same fabric because I had enough, right? So this has pockets too. But if you notice, the skirt part is not as gathered. And this, I believe, is designed um, so that the skirt starts just above the natural waist. So that's something that you can change to if you have a longer torso. You can just start it further down. But we'll discuss all that in the video course lessons. And this one, what I did was take out some of the width on the skirt so it's not as gathered. Like I didn't have to gather that much fabric to bring it in. And I find that it's super, super breezy, lightweight. I'm actually going out of town this weekend and I'm definitely taking this with me so that I can rock this with some cute sandals. And I think it is just too cute, okay? Now I've made the tank top, I've made like nine, maybe eight or nine of these in sizes for my daughter, for myself. I've made it without a full bust adjustment, with full bust adjustments, half inch, one inch, one and a half inch. And so I've played around with so many of these samples that I think I'm super ready to teach this class, to teach you all how to make those changes and so that you can figure out how to make little tweaks. Like if you see that it's gapping under the underarm, we're gonna talk about how to fix that and what you need to do to prepare yourself in the construction of the garment to set yourself up for results that you're gonna want to wear the garment out in public, okay? So that is what we're working on. Again, this is the Michelle 39 or Jali 3911 pattern. We sell the pattern in our online shop and the video course lesson is ready and open for signups right now at the early bird sale price. Another thing, let's talk a little bit about uh, skill level. If you've never sewn before, I would say if you're confident and um, you really wanna make it, I think you can totally do it, but if you're a confident beginner, say you've made maybe a handbag or a mini quilt or some type of little, you know, from my little video tutorials that I have all kinds of like little knick-knacky kind of gift-giving project ideas, if you can sew straight, if you can wind a bobbin, thread your machine, then I think you're gonna have really good results, even if the first one, and it's gonna be like everything else, the first one you make may not be super duper perfect, but after you make the first one, and you know you know what step is coming up next and how you can get through the entire project, I think you're gonna have some amazing results. And just to tell you a little bit about the last online course that I taught, which was the Jali um, 3245, it's a raglan t-shirt with a racer back tank top. I have people, I have a Facebook group called Sewing Clothes with Crafty Gemini. If you're not in that group, definitely do a quick search for it here on Facebook, add yourself or request to be added to it since it's a closed group. And um, scroll through there you will see dozens, I mean hundreds of pictures of people who are saying, I've never sewn anything before and here I am wearing a t-shirt that I made from your video courses. There is nothing more rewarding to me than to see somebody who has never sewn clothes or just got a sewing machine recently and they're tackling these stretch knits, whatever the garment is, using my video courses. That Raglan t-shirt online video course features 32 different video lessons. Yes, I could probably teach it in three or four videos, but because you're paying for the course and I'm not limited on time as far as how much content I'm putting into these lessons, I go super into depth, I cover everything, I share with you extra tips and tricks. We also have live video sessions where you can ask me questions based on the video lessons that went up that week. And if I see that a lot of people are asking a specific question, or like, I'll give you an example, in that tank, or in the racer back tank top class with the raglan t-shirt, several ladies wrote me and said, hey, is there a way to change the racer back section of the tank into a regular scoop neck because I don't like that the bra strap shows on the side because the racer back tank, you know how it kind of does these backward letter C's on the side. And I said, sure, I'll turn that into a video lesson. So I created a lesson showing everybody how to hack and change the pattern pieces to make the back of the tank top the same as the front, the scoop neck, just a slightly higher, but now you get the coverage of the bra straps on the side. So even as we go through the video course, lessons that I don't anticipate doing from the beginning, as questions arise and we get going in the class, I'll add other ones on there. So 32 video lessons on that one. I can't even tell you how many are gonna be in this one, but I anticipate there's gonna be at least 20 full video lessons, okay? Now, when you sign up, 
You'll log into your account on my website at craftygemini.com. Remember the early bird sale price I see somebody else was asking is $50. That's only valid until this coming Sunday, June 23rd at 11.59 p.m. After that, it goes up to $75. You can still sign up for the class anytime. The Raglan t-shirt, the Racerback Tank one, the Charlie Bomber jacket course, all those classes, they're still available for anybody to sign up you would just be signing up at the regular price and not the early bird. So if you follow me on social media, if you're signed up for my email newsletter, you're the first ones to find out about those early bird sale prices of any of my online clubs or video courses. All right, hey Margie. And so remember 50 bucks, it goes up to 75 on Sunday night. And then we are going to be covering everything from taking your body measurements, understanding the size chart on the jelly patterns, how to pick your size and jelly patterns, how to trace out the pattern, how to cut the pieces out. And I'll tell you, if you're a confident beginner, maybe you're thinking, ooh, I really like that, I wanna try it, but I don't feel too, too confident. This is a key element right here to look at on the back of these patterns. This little box here shows you how many pieces are included in the pattern. One, two, three, four, y'all. That's it. So if you don't think you can make this, I say think again. With my super step-by-step -step video lessons, you're not gonna have a problem, okay? And the tank top, I'll tell you, when we start off with view B, the first one, all we're cutting out is two pieces of this one for the front and back, and two pieces of this one for the facing front and back. That's it. When you see how quick and easy this thing comes together, it's gonna blow your mind. And actually, views A and B, even though they, they're the same tank top, one just has a facing and one is fully lined, you're gonna learn different techniques because there's French seams on one, we're gonna practice hemming it, we're gonna practice adjusting the shoulder straps, all this kind of stuff that you can do. And I have a full video course that's going up on just the full bust adjustment because I know most of us probably have a, a, a bust size larger than a B cup, okay? So that's what I'm gonna show you also, which comes in handy for when you're making things out of these lightweight woven fabrics that don't have darts. So this doesn't even have a dart and it's still, you can see the pictures on the course description page of me wearing different ones and it still fits, uh, fits great. And I have a bust cup size of about a C or to D, kind of in that range, depending on the bra that I'm wearing, okay? Awesome. So Kay says she's excited uh, to make this one with the fabric that I helped her choose. So she came into my shop and bought classes in person. Debbie says, not me. Girl, not everybody's larger than a B cup. If you're a B cup or smaller, easy peasy. You won't even have to do a full bust adjustment, so it's one less you know step for you that you'll have to hack the pattern to. And I'll tell you, I made one without a full bust adjustment and it still fits fine. It fits like, I can tell if I go like this, it's just like a hair too snug right there, but it's totally super cute and totally wearable, but you know, it's always a good place. And that's what I like to do with these patterns when I'm testing them out to see if I'm gonna teach it, is to make one through and through just using my size. And when they come out cute and totally wearable with zero modifications, that's why I'm using these Jolie patterns. They're amazing. The pattern drafting is impeccable. I'll show you how it comes. Remember that we have the hard copy patterns. They are sold separately. Holly says, I'm loving your videos from Maine, Vanessa. Hey, Holly from Maine. Awesome. Julie says, great haircut. Thanks, Julie. <laughs> I'm loving these curls, y'all. Isn't it fun? I feel like I'm so hyper when I talk. It just adds like a little bit more spunk to how I already am. So here is the pattern, the Michelle pattern. That's it. In this one sheet, they're able to put in all, what, 28 sizes. All the sizes are on here. All the pieces for all three views, A, B, and C, and the illustrations, the instructions in English and French. How they do it, I don't know, but they are literal geniuses when it comes to this garment drafting or pattern drafting of garments, okay? So this is what we're gonna be working from. Because there's 28 pattern or 28 sizes in the one pattern, we are definitely gonna be on Team Trace It because you need to take advantage of all the sizes that you have. You cannot just cut into this pattern. It's gonna be a huge waste uh, because you have so many sizes, right? So why cut into it and then you can't go back and use the rest of the sizes? So, and again, remember I said there's only four pattern pieces. So if you're making a tank top for yourself, you only have to trace out two pattern pieces. Guys, we're gonna fly through this class. I feel like you're gonna learn so much. If you started off and taken some of my online video courses, or have done some of my free video sew alongs where I teach you how to work with stretch knit fabrics, this is the perfect next step for you to work with these lightweight wovens. And if you've never worked with lightweight wovens like a rayon chalet, I'm going to share with you some tips on how to lay out your fabric correctly so it's still on grain, so you can cut evenly, 
and so that the fabric doesn't shift on you, which can often happen when we're working with more lightweight fabrics, okay? Hi, Miss Ethel. Debbie says, even better, two pieces. Girl, it's so quick and easy. It's the perfect garment to whip up for the summer and even for the fall, and you can layer up. Like this little dress, how cute would that look with a little jean jacket or a little cardigan over top of it? Super easy. And remember, if you're asking about length, you can make it longer or shorter. If you have a teen or kind of um, a 19 or 20 year old, like when I was that age, I would have definitely shaved a couple inches off of this to show a little bit more legs. You can totally do that. But the silhouette and the overall shape of the garment is so flattering. I'm not a huge fan of dresses. So when we finished the Raglan t-shirt class, I ran a poll in the Facebook group that I have. It's a private group called Sewing Clothes with Crafty Gemini. If you wanna join us, do a search for that group here on Facebook and um, you can click to like ask us to add you to the group since it's a closed group. And everybody, the number one choice of what the next online class was uh, they wanted to make a summer dress. And I'm thinking, oh my word, I don't even wear summer dresses. This is a brand new wardrobe staple for me because I can wear little shorts underneath. My thighs are really big so they rub and I'm not a huge fan of dresses. And for my lifestyle of like milking a cow every morning on the farm and stuff like that, but this right here, I'm making little biker shorts, putting them under the dress. It's super breezy in a lightweight rayon like this, a totally new wardrobe staple, okay? Okay, Victoria's asking, hi Vanessa, will you be helping us adjust the waistline if we need to? So a couple of the things that I'm gonna show you how to do in the video lessons is make it just as it is. I have an option for finishing off the seam allowance with elastic in case you wanted to cinch in a little bit more and not be so loose fitting because Keep in mind, it is a loose fitting garment. Not loose fitting like when I did the Butterick 3214 shirt sew along, you remember, those of you that watched that free sew along I did on my YouTube channel where the ease was like a ridiculous amount of eight to 10 inches. Not that loose, but it's still loose fitting. It's not really cinched in at the waist. And if you think about it, it can't be because there's no closure. You have to be able to get this thing over your head. So if the waistline is too tight and you have a really cinched in waistline, how are you gonna get it over your shoulders to then come back in at the waistline, right? It needs to be wide enough to fit over your shoulders first and then come in at the waist. So you already know that it's gonna fit looser here, okay? But with the elastic option, and let me see if I can show you a little bit, it just bounces the elastic in just a little bit, okay? But that is another option that I'm gonna show you how to finish it off. So we'll talk about tips and tricks for that. And then Kay is asking, can it be made in cotton instead of a knit? Uh, instead of a knit? So it's not made out of a knit. This is made out of woven fabric. So we're working with Rayon Shally, any other lightweight knit. And I'll read you what the pattern says exactly. This is designed for lightweight woven fabrics. So wovens are not knits, okay? They're woven like a quilting cotton, but don't use a quilting cotton for this. You could get away with it, I think, for the little kids ones because they're more flat chested and it's just gonna drape over their body flat even though it's kind of more A-line fitting. For adults that have a bust, you're gonna need something that flows a little bit more to kind of drape over the bust line, okay? And that's why we're gonna be doing a full bust adjustment also. But again, it's made for lightweight woven fabrics with a soft hand and nice drape. And then they give you some examples. Chiffon, Georgette, Rayon Chali, Crepe de Chine, Silk Charmeuse, and so the one that I think is most readily available is gonna be the Rayon Chalet, and it works beautifully for this pattern. So that's what I'm gonna recommend. If you have a huge fashion fabric stash, feel free to play around with some stuff that you have that fits within these requirements. That's what's gonna give you the best results. Now, I have made it for my daughter, and let me grab the fabric so you can see how it drapes, or maybe I should say how it doesn't drape. Hold on. On the course description page, you'll be able to see my daughter wearing the shirt, the same Michelle tank that I made for her, the one with the facing, so not fully lined, out of this fabric. Now, can you see how sheer this kind of is? So it is fluid, but it's still 100% cotton. This is actually 100% GOTS certified organic cotton by a company called Mona Luna. I love their stuff. And this is their cotton lawn, so it's pretty sheer. Can you see how you can see through this layer? and you can still see those dots. Those dots are on the back layer and they're metallic dots. So that's how sheer it is. But because you have that facing, it's just the two layers of the cotton lawn make it just opaque enough to be perfect for a nice little summer shirt here in Florida, okay? So I made my daughter one out of this in a size eight and she's seven years old. It looks so cute on her, 
but it does fit a little bit A-line. She's flat, right? Because she's a little kid. So it fits her fine. For an adult, I probably wouldn't unless you're okay with it being a little bit more kind of A-line, even though it's this lightweight. So I'm not going to say no to 100% cotton. You just have to make sure that you find the right one. I think Georgette, you can get some cotton Georgettes like that. Um, that might work also. Silk Charmeuse, you're already getting into pricier fabrics. So I would stay away from those, especially if this is going to be like your first or second time even trying garments. Rayon Chalet is really affordable. I mean, we sell most of ours for like $10 a yard. And hold on, one more thing here. Let's talk about this. And we'll talk about this when we uh, discuss it in the video lessons. But the pattern calls for 45 inch wide fabrics. So a lot of people, when they come to the shop to buy fabrics for it, they're like, whoa, it says I need three and a half yards of fabric. Yeah, because it's saying if you're working with fabric that's 45 inch wide. So I'm going to walk you through all this. These are all things that you need to know how to read, understand, and decipher before you start spending your money on fabric or, for, God forbid, cut into it, okay? The fabrics that I sell that are Rayon Chalet are 57 inches wide, 56 inches. It's a lot wider than the accounted for 45 inches. So you're obviously not going to need three and a half yards of a fabric that's wider, okay? So we'll talk all about that in the video lesson. We'll lay out the pattern pieces so you can see and we'll go over how much to get if you are gonna make it out of a wider fabric. Keep all those things in mind, okay? Trudy's asking how much fabric is needed for the partially lined top. So that's gonna depend on your size and whether or not, like we were just talking about, you're working with fabrics that are wider than 45 inches or not, okay? We will cover all that in the video course. So that's that. Now let me show you some of the pattern pieces. Now I trace off onto this product called Create a Pattern. I sell it in my shop in a big roll. I'll show you what it looks like. I don't sell it online because it's an awkward shape. But for those of you that are local, swing on by here when we're open, of course. Let me not fall to the floor on my rolly chair. But you can see how wide it is. I used to use tissue, medical examination paper, stuff like that. You can find a ton of affordable options, but I really love this stuff. It's by Bozel. Barbara's asking what the clothes group is called again. It's called Sewing Clothes with Crafty Gemini. So just do a quick Facebook search and you can um, ask to join that group. So that's what I trace all my pattern pieces to, okay? So here I have pattern piece B and this one I wrote on it, size Z, which is what I cut out. That's the Jolie size, which is the equivalent of a US size 14 ish okay 14 16 ish and then in us ready to wear i should say and so size z and this one says it has a one inch full bust adjustment so i've already created the pattern with the full bust adjustment and redrafted it okay let's see uh ah, jill says time to make the drive come on up girl i know you live a little while away but it is totally worth it it's 46 inches wide and it's five yards long on this roll and i think we sell it here for what 12.99 this is my fave my absolute most favorite thing and you know in garment sewing you're kind of cutting out and tracing these weird shapes but keep all the excess pieces because then when it comes to tracing out a little pocket a small gusset on some leggings for kids you still have those pieces and you don't waste it all okay so this is another one this is a tank top size x um, this was a smaller size that I cut out with a half inch full bust adjustment. So I'm telling you, I've made samples of every single kind of size and full bust adjustment combination that there is. And I'm going to share all that information with you in the video course. If you're just tuning in, we're talking about my new online video course for the Michelle Tanks and dress class using Jali pattern 3911. This is it. You can head on over to my online shop at craftygemini.com. Click on the shop tab. You'll see the video course open right now for signups. Early bird sale price starts right now, 50 bucks only, but the price goes up to $75 this Sunday, June 23rd at midnight, okay? So if you wanna get in on it, and remember that all my video courses, my online clubs, all the stuff that I offer that's paid for never expires. So if you're busy this summer, you're traveling, and you can't get to it, no worries. Whenever you get back home, whenever you retire, whenever you have time, you'll be able to log in and all the video courses will be there for you, okay? So here's an example. Size Z with a one inch full bust adjustment. And this is the facing pattern piece for size Z with the full bust adjustment, okay? Boom, boom, two pattern pieces, you have a tank top. I'm like dying to show you all these video lessons to teach you how to make this because I cannot wait to see all the tank tops that y'all are gonna be making. 
And so I'm gonna show you, don't get a little overwhelmed when I show you this, but I'm gonna show you how to make a full bust adjustment. Don't freak out. I'm gonna walk you through each step, okay? So that you can make this, okay? Boom, boom. Then we trace off the actual pattern piece after the adjustment, so we save it and we know, hey, if it works, it's tried and true, crank them out by the dozens, okay? So this is the tank top. Those of you that are asking about length, Guys, we are just gonna copy the hem and make it longer. And I'm definitely gonna show you how to do that in the video course. Super easy hack. I feel like a lot of times people kind of block themselves mentally like, oh, I don't like the V-neck. Make it a round scoop neck if you want to. I mean, you can make all these changes when you're making your own clothes. It's too short, it's too long. Just make it shorter or longer. Totally adjustable, okay? So these are all my pattern pieces. I'll show you something. You see how lightweight they are and they don't sound crinkly. It's not like pattern exam like a medical examination paper that's super crinkly and it tears easily. This stuff, and I'm yanking. I don't know if it's gonna break on me or not, but look, my favorite stuff. If you're local, come by. Online, you might be able to find it, but I find that it's super expensive just because look at it. It's like this long tube, super annoying to ship. I don't have even packaging to send this off, okay? Carla's asking, when are you posting the first video? So when you sign up for the class, if you get in at the early bird sale price, you'll get an emailed receipt. If you don't see it, check your spam or junk folder. Very important because that's the same email address where I'm gonna be sending you content and information. And depending on your email service provider, it might just throw it to spam or junk. Know that if you do go through the payment page, you will automatically be sent an emailed receipt. So if you don't see it, check your spam or junk folder. It usually ends up there. In that emailed receipt, you'll get a link that says view the course. Click on the link. You're gonna log into your account on my website and then just click on the class for the Michelle Tanks and Dress course. In there, you'll see a little welcome message and there is the full course schedule posted for you. First video goes up on June 28th. And then like every other couple of days, we're posting a new video so that we can be done with this class in July. So it's gonna be really quick. The videos are going up super fast. And I know how y'all get when you start the class, you're just like, when's the next video? When's the next video? And we just want to get through the different views and crank out the projects. And that's exactly what I plan to do with this one. Hi, Patricia. She says, cute hair. Thank you. Debbie says, good. I like my tops long to hide my fluff. LOL. You silly, silly girl. Listen, it's a super cute top. Really, really cool. Uh, Dee's asking, have you considered someday doing a course for the Jolly pull-on pants? So pants is probably gonna be later on because it is one of the toughest things to fit. So I'm trying to kind of encourage more beginners, confident beginners, or people that are kind of making handbags or making quilts and want to try their hand at garment sewing. I wanted to start off with some simpler things. Not that the bomber jacket is super simple, but man, was it easy to do, right? With those welt pockets, how to put on a zipper. I show y'all how to make that jacket reversible, fully lined, all that stuff. And then we did the raglan uh, t-shirt and racerback tank. That was great. A ton of you made those super, super cute. And then we're trying our, our hand at wovens. A lot of you wanted that summer dress. And then I thought the tank top for sure I'll make. And now that I've made the summer dresses and put them on, they look super cute. April says, hey girl, you looking thin. I know everybody says that, that cutting my hair took like 20 pounds off. Even the hairdresser, as soon as she did my hair, she's like, girl. <laughs> anyway, I feel super like, ah, ah. I'm already hyper and crazy as it is, but it just makes like me feel like I can be a little bit more spunky or right? All right. Patricia says she just ordered her pattern. So a great little point to make. We do sell the hard copy pattern. This is what I recommend. Remember, we sell it for cheaper than you can get it pretty much anywhere else. $12. Even if you bought it from Jali, it's more expensive. So we sell it for 12 bucks. It's in our online shop. If you're looking for it, I know I have hundreds of products there. Just click on the sub menu for hard copy patterns and you'll see them. Okay. So we sell that there. We're going to be adding the rayon chalet fabric. Don't feel like you're in a rush unless you have some in your stash already. Um, I always recommend that you watch the video lessons once you sign up so that you can kind of visualize where we're going. Okay, this is what we need to do next. This is what the next step is and stuff like that before you jump into it. But here is our pocket piece. I trace off everything, y'all. Another one with a half inch full bust adjustment. We are gonna cover all this stuff. And then this is another thing. If you don't feel too confident jumping into making one for yourself with the full bust adjustment, there's 28 sizes. I always recommend making one for a kid first. For somebody smaller than you, maybe without the full bust adjustment, okay? And then once you make one, you're gonna be like, I'm off and running, let me make seven more, okay? So I get a lot of people that do that, that are kind of a little hesitant with making clothes for themselves. So they'll say, well, I'll make one for my granddaughter. And then once they make it, they're like, I'm on my eighth raglan t-shirt now for myself. And that's the idea. You do have that option, right? Because there's so many different sizes in here. So again, it goes from size two 
in little girls all the way to a woman's size 24. So I'll go, I'll show you, or I'll tell you the measurements. A full bust adjustment, or full bust adjustment. I'm so used to saying those words together. It goes to a full bust measurement of 51 inches, a waist measurement, natural waist measurement of 44 inches, and a full hip measurement of 54 inches, okay? And then again, remember that it's a little bit loose fitting already, okay? Uh, Victoria's asking, how much do I sell the bozel for in my shop? So the creative pattern bozel wrap or bozel roll here, we sell it for $12.99 for one roll. Okay, so if you are local to Gainesville or you want to make the drive, come on in because we don't unfortunately sell it online. Okay, so that's that. I'll see if anybody has any more questions for me. But remember, the early bird sale price started today. It runs only till Sunday night, June 23rd at 11.59 p.m. Eastern time. That's where I'm at. And then at midnight, the price goes up to $75. I think it's totally worth it because I teach this class in person and I don't even know what the price is, but I know it's over $100 because, and, and then in one day class, I can only teach you one view, right? So it's not like you sign up for a class and I can teach you all three in one day. Because it's online, because they're video lessons, they're archived for you. You can always log in and watch them. They never expire. And one thing that I always tell people, when you take an in-person class, even if you take amazing notes, I guarantee you six months later, you go back to that project and you're not gonna remember anything you did or how to do anything. When you sign up for my video courses, they're always there for you. Maybe you memorize all the steps except for one tricky little thing. You can just go back, refresh your memory on it, and then like, oh, okay, and then you go back and do it. Or, like many of you tell me that you do, rewind, pause, replay, rewind, pause, play, rewind, pause, play, and you can do that on a video course, right? You can't really do that with me in person, especially once the class is over, okay? Holly's asking, does the video price include the pattern? No, it does not. I didn't design this pattern, so I can't lump it into the video course. So the video course is what you're paying for, my instruction, in the broken down video lessons. The pattern is separate, so you do need to purchase the Jali pattern because you need the pattern to make the video course, right? Or to make the, vi the projects using the video lessons. So yes, you have to purchase the, pro the pattern separately. That's not something that's included, but we do sell it for a lower price point than you can get pretty much anywhere else in our online shop. So hopefully that helps out there with the cost, okay? Any other questions for me? And I'm leaving town this weekend, so if you have any specific questions about this, definitely just shoot me an email. I'll be sending out an email newsletter letting everybody know that the early bird sale price of 50 bucks is open right now for signups. You just have until Sunday, okay? So today is what? Tuesday? Monday. Wow, I don't even know the days. Today is Monday, so you have six whole days. So almost to next Monday to sign up at the early bird sale price. Remember, when the price goes up to 75, it ain't never coming back down. I haven't done it yet for any of my clubs or classes. And it's kind of my way to reward people who follow me on social media, who are in on what's going on, what I'm launching next, and you get uh, to take advantage <laughs> of the sale price. Laura says, will you please shake the curls one more time? Girl, just for you. <laughs> Oh, it's super fun. Look, and they don't even look wet. They're not weighed down. It really is amazing. So they're like Diva Curl products that the girl, when she cut my hair, her name is uh, Rosie Curls, like Rosie Curls. And she's um, she rents a chair at a salon near the villages in Florida. So you can look her up on uh, Instagram, R-O-S-I Curls, Rosie Curls like that. And she's amazing. If you have any type of curly hair, even if you just follow her on Instagram, scroll through, you'll see people with all different types of curl patterns. She's amazing. So she put me on the Diva Curl. Look at this. It does look a bit. <laughs> My friend's laughing at me. <laughs> uh, yes, girl. It's amazing, super fun, and funky. But you know what? I cut my hair on May 31st, and I can already feel it's gotten longer. So my hair goes super, super fast. Okay? All right. Hi, Pat. Awesome. Debbie says, your video courses are the best. Thank you, Debbie. Awesome. I'm glad you enjoy them. All right. Julie's asking, what did the bomber jacket look like? So... I don't have one in here, it's summertime, so I don't have them here, they're put up because we live in Florida. Um, if you do a search, just do Google search, type in Crafty Gemini Bomber Jacket, it'll pop right up for you, you'll see all the ones. And if you join that Sewing Clothes with Crafty Gemini Facebook group, you can type in the search box of the group, Bomber Jacket, and you're gonna see hundreds of bomber jackets that people made with my video lessons as a part of that online course. So remember, all my online courses that are paid for, they're still available for you to sign up. They're just at the regular price, which is still not that expensive considering there's 30 plus videos and you have access to them whenever. It's just that when I launch a new class and it's fresh and new, I do offer it at a sale price. 
D says she has her pattern ready, so she's ready. Awesome. Deb says that the dress was really cute on me. I know, and I don't even really wear dresses. I'm going to make a few more because I've ordered some other prints in of the Rayon Shally, so I'll have those as samples to show y'all coming up in the video course. And once we get started, I will uh, post the fabric for sale. Um, Maria says she just ordered her pattern. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Thank you, Kay. She says you're just as sweet in person as you are online. Kay came into the shop, uh, was it this weekend? Yeah, I think it was this weekend. That was awesome to meet you in real life. Super cool. All right, so no more questions for me. Remember, if you want to get in, oh, Maria says she just signed up for the video course. Awesome. Carla says she got her pattern too. Yay, I'm so excited that so many of you are going to join in. Remember, we sell the pattern. It is sold separately from the video course. The video course is 50 bucks, early bird sale price, right now until Sunday night at midnight. Then it goes up to 75 bucks. So after I'm done here, I'm going to go ahead and put a link in this post. So you can just click on it. That will take you right to the page where you can sign up. And I hope to see you all in the course. All right. Thanks, everybody, for joining me. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.